Okay, so I have watched about a million videos on how to fix the cartridges for um, these style cartridges that uh, people use, right? Okay, so most of them tell me, most of the videos that I've watched told me just to take my fingernail or some tweezers and pull that little thing, this thing here up because maybe this connection after use isn't touching the connection in my battery, right? Okay. Okay, so I did that like a million times. I pulled that thing up over and over again, put it in, nothing worked. The lights just kept blinking, telling me that something was wrong, right? So a while back, I had taken this cartridge off of my old battery and this whole thing slipped out, okay? So I just put it back in, put it back in, put it back in. Thought that, what did I do? I broke it, I broke it, I broke it. Well, if you can see, let's get a little light in here. Inside, right there, you can kind of see the wire, okay, that's in there. Now on this part that came out, it has a little hole that goes straight through it, and I thought, hmm. That wire is supposed to go through those holes. I'm gonna do this with the tool because it's kind of meticulous. So if you have tweezers or something, I would suggest you do the same and also be very gentle because you don't want to break any of the parts, right? So I took the little wire and threaded it through that hole. threaded it through the hole okay it doesn't like come out the other side or anything it just goes into that little hole and then you just kind of shove this back inside of it right Of course, I'm not pushing the buttons right, okay? So before, when it was broken and not ripping, the lights would blink telling me that something was wrong with my... Sorry, anyhow, <laughs> telling me that something was wrong with my thing. Now, the light, well, in the camera it blinks, but in real life it's just solid. smoke yay so if you have like me watched a million videos on what's wrong with my cartridge why won't my cartridge work it might not be this if this is fine okay it might not be you having to pull this thing out like all the other ones say it might just be the connection with the wire inside of here is not there or this thing pulls out because it gets stuck to here which has happened to numerous cartridges of mine so i'm sure it's happened to other people right this part you take your cartridge off and this part is stuck to the inside right here okay then you stick it back on there and oh my god now my cartridge won't work well don't worry just take the whole little nubbin out thread it through that little wire in there shove it back on stick it onto your battery and try it again i hope that helps somebody out there like me who was not getting the answers that i was looking for um, on youtube so i had to use my own noggin mixed with a couple of the hints from other videos and and bam good to go